da, da. Oh, I need more light in here, I feel. It's this, this room, the sun's like shining crazy up in here. Okay, let's see. Um, let's see if I can get more light happening. Really quick. Hey, Amanda. Let's see. Oh, sorry, I have a shadow. Y'all see the shadow of my bookcase? Because the sun is coming in through the window. And I was hoping this would be a good time. But it looks kind of dark. So I'm sorry about that. Um, but hey, everybody. I'm Lane, Crafty Life Mom. I know I have not been live in a couple weeks. But um, it's just been busy, right? We always have things going on. I wanted to come on here, though, um, and share with you guys uh, some free printables that you can get from craftylifemom.com's resource library. It's in the link that I posted or attached to the description for this slide. And it's Teacher Appreciation Week. And I have some ideas I have shared in the past. It's one of my favorite weeks because I'm always at the school with my kids. I'm doing things there. I'm even teaching there. Um, and so I just have some really cool gift ideas that are very inexpensive. You can even get everything from the Dollar Tree if you wanted to, um, to keep it as inexpensive as possible. And if not, you want to make bigger portions, you know, you can go to Walmart, your grocery stores. A lot of the things that I'm showing you are kind of like snack ideas. Teachers love to have little snacks. Um, I'm going to recommend that you don't home make anything and send it in just because of the year and the times we're in. Um, everything that I'm showing you guys today is packaged snack items or little gifties that you can give to them that are like, you know, germ kind of safe. Um, and then I have these two um, printables that you can get off of my website, Crafty Life Mom, the resource library. These are absolutely free, okay? Um, you just provide your email and you get attached to my newsletter list. And I email weekly. I don't share emails, anything like that. So it's free to be on the list. And when you're on that group, you get a password that gives you, I don't even know how many files I have on there now. I think over 100 something files um, for crafting, DIYs, and printables like these. So I'm gonna go through the gifty tags that are actually on the printable sheets. I printed more than one here because the items that I'm sharing with you are actually for my teachers. So if you are one of my kids' teachers that's watching, act surprised. Okay, so the first thing that I wanna show you is actually what they gave to their teachers today. And I thought I had a spare one already cut out, but it doesn't look like I do. So I'm gonna have to cut one of these out. Um, and my scissors are there, I'm gonna miss it. All right, so this is the first page that I'm gonna go through, and it's four tags on a page. The free printable includes two pages, okay? So there's two pages of gift tags. You can print this on regular paper, that's exactly what I did. Um, if you wanna be fancy, you can laminate it, you can put it on cardstock whatever you have but I think the tag is just good enough and like you can punch a hole in it and tie a string to the item um what I actually did was I took a little piece of the double-sided tape and just taped it right on top okay so the first little thing is thanks for always going the extra mile and the little gifty that I got for them today was the jumbo pack now you can get an easier smaller pack from the dollar store but I got mine from Walmart so if you're looking for this same one the jumbo pack has like the nice like hard box for them and you could just like tape it right on top and every printable has a spot down at the bottom for your kiddo to sign their name like you know maybe a heart and like what what you know who it's from down at the bottom so it's easy and done you just have to print the tag and put it with the thing if you want to get fancy with it which is kind of what I did today I made it a little more posh if you will I stuck it in a little clear cellophane bag like this I happen to just have these in my craft cabinet and then I took a ribbon that I had left over from Easter stuff like this one a big one it's a burlap ribbon I think this ribbon I think it actually came from the Dollar Tree. Anyway, um, tied it into like a little knot bow. And just kind of push it on down like this. Tied it tight. You can even do like a fancier bow. I guess I'll do a bow. I did a bow bow. 
Um, and you could cut the tails like into something super cute like that. And my bow's a little off center. Um, but I will show you guys just so you know exactly what I'm talking about. The double stick tape, which I don't know what's going on with that. It's a little broken. Or it's, this is a new roll. Woo! All right, here we go. Put it back in there. You know what? This never, ever fails me. Like, there's always something when I go live that's not working right. Okay, here we go. So, start this tape. Now it's sticking to me. Piece of this tape. I love double stick tape. I use it for a lot of things. One little piece on there. No fold in it or anything. And then stick the tag. Look how cute. Now it's a little more gifty, right? With the gift tag. Super cute. So that was the first thing. The second thing is, is maybe you don't want to do gum or candy or a treat like that. You can do a non-food item. And I have this printable. Same page. In case you didn't know, you are the bomb like lip balm. Okay? Isn't that super cute? I found this at Walmart. It was less than $3. So it was like two something for the natural balm. It's a key lime flavor. It has a little pineapple top so they can actually like hold it a little better in their hand than like the round EOS ones, but you can get those too. Or maybe like a pack of like the lip smith smacker lip balms and put it with this little note. You know, maybe a little bow or something like that. And that's a super cute little gifty to give to someone. Thank you. Hi, Missy. How are you? Hey, Sharon. Hey, Amy. All right, so that's two items, right? We have simple, easy, very inexpensive. A gum and a lip balm. All right, so the next thing on the page is one of my favorites. And it's, um, like I said, you could do this from the Dollar Tree or you could go... So like your Walmart or whatever and get all the things for this one. And if you haven't noticed, this week also is Cinco de Mayo. So my kids are doing something every single day for their teachers. And so on Wednesday, being Cinco de Mayo, I'm going to theme it towards Cinco de Mayo theme. And the gift tag says Nacho average teacher right and then there's a little extra space there where they could write a little note like thanks for being an awesome teacher thanks for whatever on this so i went a little bit further out with this but you could totally go to the dollar tree they have all kinds of bins there i picked up some of these bins which are super cute um one dollar right so this one's like less than five i think maybe maybe a little more because i got some of my stuff from walmart Get a little bit of this like green grass stuff and I pushed it towards the front. So it's kind of like this. I got a big bag of nachos so now they can share with their coworkers or maybe another teacher who wasn't gifted anything that day or they could have it in the cafeteria, lunch, whatever. Big bag of nachos and a jar of salsa. And you can even add like another jar with the queso, put some ribbons with it, with this little tag right here on the front. How stinking cute is this? Nacho Average Teacher. I just love that one. Um, I thought that was super cute. All right, so maybe you don't want to go that crazy and you want to do something still a little bit simpler. Um, let's see. I have, where was the other page? Um, okay, so there's still one more on that page, which is for like a Target gift card, okay? So like you just want to keep it simple. Maybe give them, you know, 10 bucks or something like that to Target. I know, I would love that. It's pretty awesome. And they always have teacher items at the Target, like dollar section or the dollar spot or whatever it's called now, over the summer. It's like intentional, I guess. So they could easily find some cute classroom things or even just whatever, a treat for themselves. So this one just says, thanks for always keeping me on Target. And they have a little... Um, Target gift card that you can stick with that one. All right, so now that's the first four, right? On the first page, the extra gum, the bomb, the nacho average teacher, or the Target gift card. So you kind of see how they kind of build in dollar value, but they're all very inexpensive and very easy to do. Second page, so I have four more ideas for you. I'm gonna share with you those. Um, like I said, you could easily do some prepackaged snacks. Teachers always kind of like that. Sometimes they don't eat during the day. 
um, and having a little snacky at the end of the day or something like just right there ready to go for them. Pre-packaged is even better. Um, don't make anything homemade. I said that at the beginning just because of our time that we're in. You know, sometimes they may not want to have that. So, um, we always have like a box of popcorn. You could get a whole box of popcorn for them. Or you could just take out one bag of the pre-packaged popcorn and put it with this. No one is better than you. And again, there's the little space right there for, you know, your kiddo to write their note. You know, thanks for being awesome. And then it says thank you on the box of popcorn. So I thought that was super cute. Another idea that I came up with, which actually thought this was super cute. Um, we really do not know what we would do without you. Pair it with a bag of pretzels. These guys are those flat snack factory, can you even say it? Um, pretzels that have like, they're kind of flat, you know, like a cracker. This bigger bag actually came from the dollar store. So $1 with the free printable, maybe a little ribbon tied around, super cute. They would love that. Um, little gift idea just to show appreciation. The last two, so there's one in each page, just so you know, one that's a uh, Target gift card or an Amazon gift card, because I figure those are probably the most easy and the most type of gift cards that most people want. So each page has a gift card tag if you want to go a little higher and get like a gift card route, or if you want to do the snack, then the other three kind of coordinate that, and then the one that has the lip balm. All right, so here are the last two. This one... I'm excited to do. I think my kids actually, because I asked them, I'm like, which ones do you want to do? Because we're doing five days of appreciation for the teachers all week. And so they really liked the next one I'm going to show you here. It's this pink one. It has like a buffalo check like napkin in the back. So like think of, you know, like a picnic is what I was thinking when I was creating this. It said, I would be muffin <laughs> without you, right? And so Panera Bread, you could go get those huge giant muffins you know, on your way into school, put this with the little baggie that goes with it and they could have like a little breakfast muffin. Or you could even, if you don't wanna do the food item, just like a $5 gift card to Panera Bread where they can get their own muffin on another day. Um, either way, attaching that would be super cute. So that's another one. And then the last one is Amazon, I already told you, and I'll show you what that one is. One of my favorites, I actually gave this um, one a little bit earlier in the year for one of my kiddos teachers was really helpful with my son and so said thanks for being one amazing teacher didn't put the word Amazon there but you guys get the idea um, it kind of looks like the logo there so that is two pages of printables that have all the gift tags pick and choose what you want do one do all of them, do five, we got four days left in the week, but you guys, make sure you show your kids, teachers, some appreciation. I think it's been one of the hardest years um, for them, and they need to see some love, right? I think, I don't know, it's just one of my favorite things to do to let them know I see you and I appreciate you. So, definitely click the link, I'm trying to find the other page. Let's see, yeah. Definitely click the link. You guys, these are absolutely free to download, print, and use them however you need to. Um, and yeah, hopefully that gives you guys some cool gift ideas. So I will see you guys next time. I have a craft and DIY that I'm going to bring to you hopefully later this week. And I will see you then. All right? <laughs> Bye!